Hey guys, what's up? This is Paul from Between the Barrier to Me. Welcome to our touring vessel. What's up? This is the driver's seat, which I've never sat in. This is where our driver, Sean, sits and drives while uh, usually instant messaging on his laptop and doing various other things that he probably shouldn't be doing while he's driving. But he's awesome and we trust him. So, uh, <laughs> this, is where, this is where our driver hangs out. Welcome to the main cabin. This is where we all uh, sit and eat cereal and argue and do all kinds of other stuff. Uh, what else goes on here? We fart, fart a lot. We fart a lot. We, uh, there's our driver, Sean, who doesn't hang out in this area too much, but uh, right now he's chilling. This is the entertainment area of the bus. We have a TV here. Uh, we pick up, on occasion, satellite TV, um, which we watch sometimes. But the biggest entertainment source is probably Blake's hard drive which contains upwards of around four million movies. Uh, <laughs> every movie ever made. Yeah, on that it's got every movie ever made. Uh, and what were we watching yesterday? We were watching Sherlock Holmes, I believe. Um, and today we'll probably watch some other type of movie, won't we? Yeah. Yes. So that's what we do here. We just watch movies and hang out and uh, that's about it. This is where our uh, tour manager puts our per diems. So we get really excited about this area right here because we usually pull out a ten dollar bill. <laughs> so it's pretty, pretty wild. And uh, this is our storage area which is really organized. Uh, everything is in a certain spot for a certain reason. This T is angled this way for a certain reason. What would that reason be? T doesn't taste good if it's straight up. It does not. Little known fact. T does not taste good when it's stored vertically. It must be stored at a 45 degree angle. Come this way. This is the gross room. This is the disgusting room that you like do not want to go into carpets. ever. <laughs> unless you have an emergency urination situation uh, in which you would pee into that hole. Um, so yeah, you want to stay out of here if at all possible. Here is a magical cabinet full of food. Cereal, Ritz crackers, peanut butter, oatmeal, light bulbs, you know, all the good stuff that you like to eat. Uh, <laughs> uh, yeah. Microwave, this cooks food. Refrigerator, this stores food to keep it cold. Uh, what's in the fridge? <laughs> I don't know if you want to look in here. But, again, perfectly organized. I don't even know what to say about this. This is an absolute disaster. Uh, but, yeah, lots of stuff. Lots of cheese, deli meats, juices, soy milks, almond milks, tofurkey, vitamin water, Cholula, energy drinks, mustard. Uh, that weird ginger ale shit. Weird ginger ale that Tommy drinks that no one else can stomach because it burns. Um, <laughs> and that's about, that's about it for the refrigerator. And that's really about it for this front cabin area. Okay. This is where we just hang out and eat. You're about to get exclusive access to the bunk area, which as you can see, usually we only allow band and crew. So, come on in. It's gonna smell a little funky in here. But uh, starting here, this is uh, Jimmy Chang's bunk. He is our tech, drum tech, multi-purpose tech. This is my bunk. Uh, let me, I usually have quite a bit of danger from the pillow. I'll sc sc scoot that off. And then the bottom bunk is our driver, Sean's bunk which you might want to get down here. This is pretty interesting. Sean wears this crazy contraption uh, on his face so that he doesn't die while he's sleeping. Uh, I don't know how you would describe it, but it's a mask that uh, forces air uh, into his face so that he continues to breathe while he's sleeping. So that's pretty interesting. And what do we have down here at the bottom? We've got an assortment of fans. Oh, there's Blake Richardson. Hey. Drummer. He likes to stay cool and he loves clamps. What do you got going on down there, Blake? I get really hot when I sleep, so I have like tons of fans. And um, that's it. I got some water in here in case you know I get parched. What, what are one these one clamps night? all about? Are they that just holding the, the fan. Yeah, they okay. Hold the fan up. Yeah, that's uh, quite. I usually have these running, and then uh, that's about it. This middle bunk. Who do we have here? Hey. Hey. He looks, he looks hey. sexy. Hey, hey, hey. 
This is the front man, Tommy hey. Rogers. Tommy, tell us a little bit about your bunk. Man, what my bunk is boring. On? I don't have anything in here right now because all my stuff's in the club. I mainly have my laptop bag in the corner here. All I do in here is read and listen to music and play on my laptop. Do That's you ever it. do you ever sleep in here? I've never slept in here. I sleep on the roof. He sleeps on the roof. No, I sleep here a lot. I have this little Velcro thing. Oh, you can store stuff I in there. I put my phone, my watch, my ring, and my wallet in this every night. And that's it. Let's move down to Johnny this bottom Masto. bunk, which I'm going to go out on a limb and say this is the most disgusting <laughs> bunk on the bus. And the reason for it is because this loser <laughs> resides in here. <laughs> what are you doing down there, Dusty? This is Dusty, guitar player. I'm writing some riffs. Check out that riff. That's a good riff. Sounds like Saigon Kick. Yeah, it does sound like Saigon Kick. What else do you do in this bunk, Dusty? Anything interesting about your bunk? <clears throat> I hang out with a fan that I put right here to stay cool and everybody smashes into it and they hate it. Yeah, um, that does suck. Mm -hmm. I just upgraded to a second pillow because uh, this bunk has been effing up my back situation. So uh, adding these additional pillow gave me some comfort for the day. I'm kinda liking it. So nice. other than the other pillow, we got the new uh, Casey strain record, some glasses. Oh, just shit in your bunk. Um I think I some water back here somewhere. You thirsty? So yeah that's the bunk area on the between the Barry to Me tour bus. Hope you enjoyed it and um, fortunately for you you can't smell it because it's not good. So welcome to the back lounge. This is kind of a junky area of the bus we tend to throw a lot of stuff back here, shoes, bags, etc. But it's also where we like to jam. Exhibit A, Dan Briggs. Hello. Uh, jamming on some guitar, writing some new licks. Uh, and I'm sure they're going to be awesome. So uh, we do that. This is my guitar. I come back here and jam. We've got baseball gloves, just a bunch of random stuff. And uh, that's really about it. There's another TV back here, but we don't even use it. Uh, most of the TV watching happens in the front lounge. This is just sort of a kind of a quiet area where we like to just come and jam on guitar or um, throw stuff, bags, shoes, etc. That's about it for the back lounge. We want to thank you guys for checking out our bus. Uh, it's been a pleasure showing you around. And uh, unfortunately now we have to go find some food. So uh, between the bear and me, signing off, thanks a lot. <laughs>